in order to bring this image into Corel and add some text to it or uh, put it into a template we can print out our films we have to first save this file so my separations are done everything's juiced up black channels generated the whole bit so now all I gotta do is go to the file menu and come down to save I'm gonna name it a bunch of twos on my desktop so I can find it quick and easy just for the purposes of this video I'm gonna put it on my desktop I hit save and that's it now if any of you have ever saved a DCS2 file out of Photoshop or Corel Photo Paint you know that there's an awful lot of steps that freehand just automated for us right there okay here we are in Corel so let's go to the file menu new we'll set up a new document make the settings that you'd like go ahead and hit OK now let's import our file we'll go to the file menu come down to import choose the file we want to work with and click on the import button you'll get this EPS dialog box be sure to to check the one that says place as encapsulated postscript hit OK now I like to just click and drag my image on screen we can center it let's go to the file menu come down to print alright now when you do the print you'll get a dialog box that that comes up here we have to hit OK for each color in our document so if there's five colors in this file or in this document they'll have five windows so we just have to hit OK for each alright now we're gonna hit cancel and that's just to bring the colors in properly so now let's go to the windows come down to dockers go to color palette manager and if you don't see the colors in your color list to the right turn off the document palette eyeball turn it back on and there's our colors be sure to watch the other videos in this how-to series.